Shout out to you all. We're going to go straight into this match. And let me tell you, I was talking to Hugs, and Hugs said that when it comes to Ganondorf, actually, he had some practice with Dream um, in the matchup. As far as uh, fighting against none is concerned, all he's focused on is just winning the battle on stage, trying to neutralize Captain Falcon, stop him from getting his momentum. And then once he knocks him off stage, right, all he needs to do is just close out his edge guards. And Hugs oh, has no. been really happy with his edge guards. As far as none is concerned, we're going to have to see how he can uh, deal with Hugs' play style of just calming players down, forcing them into shield time and time again. There it is. And Hugs again, getting that edge guard really well, putting himself in the lead. But that oh. jump right there, none reading that. You know, it's a common escape option from the edge, right? Going for the jump. So good stuff right there. None actually getting the read on that. And here we have Hugs just moving around and playing even shield dashes, which, you know, can sometimes... Ooh. Oh, oh, beautiful stuff. None bringing it back. That's right, man. That combo was really beautiful. But it's not over yet, you know. Very even game. Convincing first stock from Hugs, convincing second stock from none. Look at that, man. So, con so confident with those grabs. None trying to DI away. And Hugs... You could see he's just trying his best to react, but ooh, okay. I thought it was going to be, I don't think he was going to roof him with that, but man. Ooh, hit him with the whizzy. Look at that, man. Those double up airs, don't mess with it. Double jump early. Oh, hug saw it coming. Okay, now. Oh, that's it. Wait, is it? Okay. It kind of looked like he probably might have grabbed it anyway. He's kind of low. I don't understand how Hooks, uh, he always finds, finds the perfect place to charge his shot. And he always has a charge shot ready at all times. Yeah, man, you know, getting the... W w once he's able to, like, knock the opponent off stage, that gives him an ample amount of time to charge the, uh, the, you know, the charge shot. As well as in between KOs, too. Nice shot right there by Hugs. Okay. Is he going to go for the high recovery? Look at Hugs! Oh, oh my god! That oh my god. was so oh amazing. Oh my god, that was amazing. My man said, I'm going to cover this option. No psych. He knows. He, he knows. knows. Man. I'm telling you right now, man. Hugs knows. Up there, but a little bit too far up. Oh, Hugs trying to get his feet back on the ground, man, and he's just. Realizing that he needs to maintain this lead. He probably might fire a charge shot if none jumps in the air. Oh, he's just trying to scare him. That's it. The charge shots, they keep the players honest. You know? And there you have it. That cross cancel grab on that uh, sour spot back air. Very Hugs nice wait. Hugs needs to watch out with him. <gasps> okay. That was just unfortunate. They have, that, nice. they have that little hook on the right part of Battlefield. Doesn't even latch on. Man, Battlefield just screws over so many uh, characters' recoveries. Come on, Sakura. Come on. Oh, all right. Ooh. So he's just going to take the damage. Is that like a phantom shield bolt? Definitely a phantom. <laughs> That's crazy. Double jump. Oh, there it is. Hugs waited. Trying to put himself in position. He's just waiting. It's getting really tense right here. <gasps> Hugs, oh, so close. Very brave. Because what if none does a combo? <gasps> This might be it. Could be I. My man yeah. is he's back. There's a double jump. Oh, none is trying to find a way out. Hugs giving him that false <laughs> sense of security by moving back. The tiniest charge shot. Uh-oh. Yeah, and you see how Hugs respected none on the platform. He's like, darn, he has he has shield drops. Uh I gotta respect him. <gasps> Yo, so he just full jumped over him, man. man All right, here we go. Empty jumps. And that's an up tilt. That was a that was a pretty exciting game one. Oh, I have first to say. game in favor of Hugo. It was fast and slow. But man, Nun is so good with those uh, empty hops uh -huh. into grab. Mm -hmm. He is so good with those. <sighs> and we're going straight into Ganondorf. The man realizes that Hugs is just only two games away, so Let's he's just going to dig deep. Ganondorf did get him a win before in the past. The dream Not at this is still alive. Yeah, the dream is definitely still alive as dream lives on and none. Hugs, let me tell you something. Hugs did practice with Dream, though, so... Oh, no. Yeah, Hugs probably might be a bit more confident. When I spoke to him, he did say 
that he isn't 100% too comfortable with the Ganondorf matchup, but thanks to him practicing with Dream, he feels like he might be able to do well. But as we can see here, none taking advantage of the potential unknown factor that is here. Oh, that's another black chop there, but none is no stranger to getting those wall techs. Uh, but it's interesting how he uh, changes it up from uh, wall tech into up B and wall tech into a ba instant back air. Because oh. um, uh, if people are waiting for the back air, the up B might still hit because it's command grab. That's right. Oh, these guys. It's going head to head here. Man, they're just both swinging. Oh, no, that's oh. going to KO, man. Down throw to up smash. See you later. I don't think anyone would have expected that. Uh uh. Yeah, Hugs definitely looking to just try to capitalize on edge guards, noticing that the stage is just so small. Basically, the moment you're near center, you could, and if you get a down smash, you could potentially send the opponent off to the edge. Oof. Oh man, these dash attacks. Brave. Oh, but the cloud to the rescue, man. That was very slick movement by not just to avoid the missile. Putting out all those uh, attacks like that. Oh, oh my gosh! Looking like Luigi. Seriously, I feel oh, oh hugs no. faltering here. But man, none is moving right now. Yeah, movement like that is so unpredictable. It catches people off guard. Oh, oh no! Oh, is this it? 64 oh damage God. in a blink. 65, huh? Man, none is looking overwhelming. Oh my gosh. How do you fight this Ganon? He moves so fast. That's definitely the question that Hugs is asking right now. I mean, we've seen him beat it before, right? Whenever he has his uh, charge. Oh God! The man just came back on stage and the immediately. The quickest back here. Yep. He won getting harassed by a fly. Yeah, man, this fly is actually pissing me off, dude. I, I don't want to clap it because flies are disgusting. I'll clap up. Get out of here, fly. Please. Shoe fly, literally, stop bothering me. <laughs> I don't know why it's here. All right, sorry guys. I got a little. <laughs> got a little distracted by Mr. Fly, but we're back. <laughs> Jeez, dude. This fly is actually. Sorry guys, back to the match. <laughs> Let's go. Freaking fly. Gun <laughs> versus Hugs. Ganon versus Samus. <laughs> thank you, thank you. We're Final back. destination. Yes. Oh. Let me let me gather. Oh my god, it put itself <laughs> in my it's in my eye! What? <laughs> <laughs> it touched it touched my face. Oh, Alright, so anyway, back to the match, ladies and gentlemen. Hugs versus Nun. Here we go. Um we saw on this stage, whenever Hugs has a charge shot, the he, he usually lets it rip on Nun. Hug, Nun has been known to shore hop up quite a bit early, allowing Hugs to sneak in his projectiles. Yeah. You know, you could destroy the missiles, but you can't quite destroy the charge. Yeah, man, uh, this stage limits uh, Ganon's movement so much. <laughs> he has no platforms to just slide around like we saw on Yoshi's. Uh. Oh, and Nun trying to go for his uh, runoff stage spot. Well, runoff. Rising back here per usual. Okay. Let's see if we could uh, dissect this, what's going on here between these players. Nun just trying to push Hugs to the back. He notices that Hugs likes to wave dash back a lot. And that could be a boon to Nun when it comes to gaining stage presence, right? Oh, the power shield. Oh, yeah, definitely. Allowing, you know, basically a tool that can help dissuade Hugs from firing projectiles willy nilly. Man, out of his last uh, tech uh, 15 tech opportunities, none has hit 14 of them. Oh, my man is up. You saw that he went through the obstacle course, ducking under the missile, and a fist to the face. Trying to crack that the helmet off. I love it. He almost hit him with the... Oh, get him out of here. <laughs> Two stocks apiece. I feel like the forward tilt, it just looks so disrespectful. <sighs> there it is again. He's going through the obstacle course. Nice clean combo. Not quite ending in a knockdown. Yo, wait, what's Nun's shield like? What's what that shield be like? He's trying to see if he can get him, but Nun, I like how he said, I'm going to just let that shield recover instead. Yeah. Very smart. 
Uh-oh. Oh, man. There's the missile. Okay, this time he managed to actually get none. How about the... Dude, it's so scary. Nobody wants to trade with Ganondorf. That's like the last thing. Punish. The man, Hugs is doing a great job with those uh, missiles. Uh-huh. Oh! <gasps> But that fist, just sending hugs all the way to the other side of the stage. And back. Right now it's like a ping pong between these guys. Constant volley, hugs a little late right there on the edge guard. Ooh. That might cost him. Okay. All right, Damn. good stuff. Hugs trying to cover numerous options there. But the up tilt, doing Very what nice. it does best. Very right. nice. Very nice indeed. Okay. Gonna see a quick follow-up. It looked like he waited a bit too. Oh man. We're gonna see a reverse up here. His hug's gonna shoot from the edge. Ooh. With that crack on the helmet. But hugs. Stays alive. Oh man. I mean that screw tech was definitely good. It gave him a clean 12. I haven't seen uh, Hux go for um, any grabs at all this game. Yeah, I mean, here's the thing, right? You went for grab against Ganondorf. Oh, hey, yeah. what's going to happen? <laughs> Triple stomp. So much damage. Hux probably trying to see if he can just Ooh. get a, a read on Nun's movement. Maybe fire a missile and then run under and try to get a dash attack as Nun short hops. But this time, Nun's sneaking in with that run-up grab. And Ganondorf so slow, but he's still got it. Man, Hux, Hux is so oh. tricky. Oh, are we going to see a stomp? Oh, God. Oh! Whoa! What was that? He went for the wall jump, screw attack, and that screw attack slammed oh, none man. into the stage, stage spiking him down into the abyss. Is that, is, is that going to be the new Samus deck for Gimps? I can't believe it, man. I, I don't know. I mean, I don't even think Hugs intended to do that, but he's probably going to just take that win all the way to the bank for sure. That was so jank. Okay, game four here, grand final set one. Possibly might be the last set as Hugs is on the verge of a win here. None trying to see if he can just break down that shield, spacing a lot of aerials. But here comes Hugs with his opportunity, trying to just get edge guards. That's what he told me. When I had a conversation with him, I had tried to actually have an extended conversation with him when it comes to this matchup. But he said it's all about him trying to win on stage and get the edge guards. And we're going to see it right here. Edge guards. Show me what you were talking about, Hugs. And there it is. Oh, man, missing the tag. But, you know, Ganondorf on this stage, it's definitely going to be quite hard to get the KO on him. Much better stage than Final Destination for Ganon. Oh, yeah. And look at that shield. You can't block against Ganondorf forever. If you're blocking against Ganondorf, Ganondorf's going to be happy. Nice. Hugs just capitalizing on the, not being in the air yet again. Okay. Whoa, clean wave land, but he's going to take a back air for it. At least he has that 36% differential. He's looking good. Jeez, the quick duff to the head again, man. It never stops. That's a free grab punish. Oh. And none trying to read it. Oh, this is what I was talking to you about. Oh. Okay, so he got one down here. But... There it is, there it is. We back. Such great use of the command grab. Such good damage. Ooh. Nun said you thought you could just stay in the air and try to read my aerial movement, but I got this up here. Ooh. Ooh. The slide up from the platform into the edge guard. Ooh. Yeah, man. Tricky movement. I'm getting a lot of good grabs. I wonder if he thought Hugs would have been airborne after that forward throw, which is why he tried to read and like a double jump. Solid, but there's the trade, and this trade actually benefits Hugs a lot, and this is why. That quick seizure of the ledge. Oh, man. Oh, I would be so scared against that charge shot. Oh, there it is again, the defense. And I think we saw Hugs employ Light Shield. I'm not too sure. I might be wrong. 
Oh, that. Oh, there's the fair again. And Hugs looking down. He's like, all right, man, I got to keep my cool. Oh, my God. None missing the shield drops. Yep. He rolled twice. Oh, man. But the man is actually still. Wait, wait. Let's so go. Winning. <laughs> that is so scary, just dancing around the Ganondorf's aerials. Nun, oh, Nun almost got the really slick grab. Oh, Hugs giving him another opportunity, and now we get to refresh the double jumps yet again. Oh, this could be Nun's last talk of the tournament. Oh yeah, definitely. Oh, the hardest read right there. He said, you know what? I notice that he keeps jumping, and a lot of times I keep blocking. Why don't I just take to the skies, challenge him with my own flames? Ooh, but he needs to be careful, man. He's at 80 right now. And to Ganondorf, yeah, that's juicy damage right there. Ooh, terrible shot, Hugo. Terrible shot, Hugo. JK. Uh-oh. Where is none going to go next? Ooh. Let, let's go. Game five. Oh, man. Oh, the that road. chase. Okay. Another tech chase. There it is. Hug setting up. He might be in a really good spot here, but falling off the stage in, the, in that manner is not what he needs. Wispy. Oh. Yes. Oh, my God. It's a KO. Let's go. We're still in the game. Hugs. Actually, if he was able, if Hugs was actually able to block that, that would have been a punish. He could have knocked the man off stage, fired a couple missiles, forced Nun to recover low, and then after that, set up with the with the uh, up tilt that of we've course. seen before, or maybe even like a ledge up aerial. But now we have a potential reset situation with Nun going to a stage where Hugs has less room to breathe. Man, I, I, I'm oh. not sure I agree with this counter. Yeah, dude, I'm actually. Oh my gosh! I actually think this is one of Ganon's strong states. Dude! Oh, oh my god! It's already happening! Oh man. Hugs might be losing control. Okay. Wait. I might be wrong here. I might be wrong. Oh. He hasn't even touched him yet. Oh, up air. Okay. Oh, he just crouch canceled the Ganon fair! Oh, that god. move is so vicious! 17! No 38s. All right, look at that, man. Another one? Oh. Oh, he actually stood in shield there. This what? is what Nun is talking about when he, when he mentions that smart drifts are better than of course. good recoveries. You gotta watch out. Where's the jump? Too low, too low, oh. too low. Good by Hugs, good. Definitely smart. Okay, yep, he has to pull back. He has to pull back. Retreat because he notices that his shield is getting smaller. And none, none has to get in there. He can't just let Hugs run away. Let's Man. see what he does. Of course, it's not easy. You know, easier said than done. Hugs' his jab pressure is just, how do you deal with it? Sometimes players just with light shield, you know, shield oh, the eye. Oh, of course. Oh, he is brave, trying to jump forward towards a Ganondorf who is swinging. Let's go. All right. Let's see if he can uh, get, the, get the search card. Super slick movement right there by oh. Nun, and he manages to get the back air. We're at three stocks piece, 65% differential here. Three stock to three stocks. Yes, is sir. there going to be a bracket reset? It's potential. Trying to get that spot dodge read instead. Hug says down smash. No, you take my down smash instead, good sir. Oh, what a... Okay, him dash attacking into center stage was actually really good. You need that center. You need to keep the control. How is he going to be able to knock him off? Hugs! I like that he's going off uh, for uh -huh. center stage more. Yep, look at Hugs. I love that by none. Going to the top platform like that, and it's just dropping down really quick right on top of Hugs. And now look at this. Are we going to see an up air? Yes. Good up air just to force him off. Nice. And he threw out that forward air. Hugs thinking, oh, he missed. But no, not quite. False sense of security gets that no other jump, up air. No jump on Hugs. Yeah. He's going to get oh! stopped. Oh! Whoa. 
That was too crazy, man. <sighs> Smash Brothers Melee, ladies and gentlemen. Ooh. Oh, how you gonna just do it raw on him like that with the 15% keeping the man in the air? Man, the momentum just keeps going in favor of none each second. Dude, this is so intense. You can't see, you can't get too close with those jabs as none was able to get that shield grab. Could. Hugs following up. Good clip uh, for, uh, to weave back as well by Hugs, but those wizard feet are catching him off guard, man. Oh, he ran into the grab. Oh, where's the punish? Tried. That's right. Okay, tense moment. Yes. Another grab. Man. And usually whenever I see those grabs from Nun, Hugs would toss out the down smash to stop Nun from getting the grab. But we don't see the down smashes in neutral anymore. He's at high percent. He's probably afraid of getting attacked and losing the stock. Okay. Good job. He gets the charge shot. All right. He's able to attack on a, a nice approximate 20% damage. Ooh, not being on the platform like that. Looked like an opportunity for Hudson to possibly get an attack, but there's the loss of a charge shot. Oh, man, that's a full stack lead for none. Okay, Hugs, Hugs may not be looking too bad here. And then again, he's on the platform. None? What are we going to see from none here? Oh, so Hugs went for the down smash, but I think it was a backwards one. Man, I love those weights and to just walk into you and grab. Uh huh. So smart for none. Oh, that down smash. That's one gonna be one. the bracket reset? Maybe. 97% last stock here. And this time, none is at 38%. Ooh. Ooh, there it is, people. We have another set of melee. It's not over yet. If you thought you were going to leave the building, you better get seated. Let's go. Get comfortable, because we're in for another ride. Set two of grand finals here at Smash Factor 2 Melee Singles. Hugs versus none. Zero, zero on the scoreboard. Now, here's a question I have for you, my friend. Do you think that Nun has the download on Hugs? I don't think he has the download on Hugs because I don't think there's such a thing. I don't think you can download a player as smart as, as Hugo Gonzalez. So do you think that maybe what happened is that Hugs might have just lost his momentum? Maybe he's getting uh, exhausted or? Um, I think uh, this set is fresh and we're gonna see Hugo fight it out because I don't think he's the type of player to like just mentally get defeated, you know? Understood. All right, well, well let's see what happens here, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, Raze, and let's do it. Oh, man. So much momentum from that dash. He was able to just connect two up airs, and right there, it almost looked like he was going to get that up B on hugs. A potential knee right there, but now we have none. Trying to possibly put hugs in anti-Captain Falcon mode. So that when he least expects it, he goes right back to Ganondorf. You look like a shield stab there, dude. Oh, man. <clears throat> Alrighty. Good fake out right there by Hugs. As you saw, when there was invincibility, he went to the top platform and just dipped right back down. Ooh. You gotta do that sometimes to keep your opponent Very on their nice toes. Very nice fastball to yes, uh, avoid the charge shot. Mm. Maybe the tech chases. Oof. We're seeing more short, uh, screw attacks now. I feel like knowing how damaging oh. Ganondorf can be, Hugs was a little bit more, a little bit afraid, you know, to play his usual game. Man, it's looking like Hugs is just too good against this Captain Falcon, but commentator yeah. scares, of course. Uh, I definitely still agree with you. <laughs> High recovery, of course. Ah. Uh. There's the patience. Jeez. Look at Nuts the eye. Oh, he had that neutral out for a hot minute. <laughs> the backwards compatibility right there. <laughs> oh. oh, he wanted more. <gasps> oh yes. my gosh! He had to he earned that KO. If Hugs survived that, I would have been like, come on, I Zach. do not understand Nun's punishment. It is something else. I don't think he wants anybody to understand his punishment. It's crazy, right? So hype. So hype. He doesn't want you to know how to DI his combos. He just wants you to fade into an oblivion. Fade into darkness. Oh. Oh, gosh. Oh. All right, 103 right now, Hugs. 
The turnaround by oh, none. Man, missing the tether. Gosh. This Captain Falcon is nothing to be messed with. So, just as we were saying that he was doing better with Ganon, now he's one stock lead against uh, Hugs. I don't know what's going on, but none is just putting on a great show right, right here for everybody. Oh, and Hugs having a bit of a tough time trying to catch Captain Falcon as he's dashing. Manages to sneak in that backer, though. So now here we go. We're on, on the final stock here. That DI looked like it helped out Hugs a lot. Oh my gosh. Okay, we live in though. Hugs really wants a knockdown from a dash attack, but none knows that. That's why none waited. That's why none waited. He very, got the down throw. Very smart. Yep, got the tech juice afterwards. Hugs needs to start employing more patience. These these uh these far reaching, you know, I mean he's he's reaching really hard to get the dash attacks and they're not working out for him. He probably might have to overshoot. Hugs taking off the headset. Is he gonna try to rely on the energy of the crowd? Let's see. Oh, I didn't even notice that uh, Nun didn't wear the, he the headset in the first place. Oh, yeah. he. And right now, Hugs also, you can tell that not only is he... Uh, <laughs> all I have to say is Hugs is not even letting the Nun be seen on the camera. Look at that. He's blocking the man. <laughs> <laughs> man. He's like, nah, man. The camera is all mine. Yeah, Hux wants to be everywhere. He wants to be seen behind the commentator's desk. He wants to be seen in front of none. It's true. <laughs> but yeah, SD wasn't quite good for uh, Mr. Nun. But I mean, the way he punishes with Captain Falcon, I feel like he'll be able to bring it back very soon. Oh. Oh, Hux. Yeah, this, these are preemptive. These are signs of preemptive nice. moves from an opponent. Hugs needs to cool it. None shield drops are on point. Oh, getting the grab too. That punish. Yeah, I, I love the fact that none is starting to call out those grab attempts from Hugo. That's true. Hugs needs to be more. When it comes to getting those screw attacks. Oh, oh my gosh, oh my he's God. not even done. Death? Not quite. This man is... Hugs couldn't even make it across. You know, knowing that the bomb jump usually helps people with, when it comes to horizontal recovery, but he was so far out. But it's never over for Hugs. We'll see. He is a man that would fight to the last stock of his tournament. That's right. Wow, and just aiming it straight for Captain Falcon's helmet. <laughs> Mess up on the shield drop right there by none. Oh, the man blocked the time. After an aerial raptor boost? Oh, he doesn't care, he's letting the rock! Oh. Oh. Even game. Let it rock, man. That is Captain Falcon for you. Man, Nun is starting to go for those uh, safe double uppers instead of trying to look for the knee because he realizes that Hugo is just on point with his DI outwards. Dude, I can't take this, man. It was Captain Falcon. Okay, <laughs> he just ducked under the missile. He's like, sup? He ain't got no worries. Oh, man. Oh, but the, okay, there we go. I definitely, I definitely want to see these guys go down to the wire. Both of these guys are bounty hunters, right? Captain Falcon and Samus, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, uh, I do not know. Yeah, I think so. The Battle of the Bounty Hunters here in the Grand Finals of Super Smash Bros. Melee. I'm hyped. Uh-oh. Oh. Nice. Did he cut him off? Oh. Yes, he did. Very good missiles. You don't want to be in that position against Hooks. Definitely don't. Just trying to carry him off there. Oh. Yeah. Clear, get, clear mistake. Can I get those nice shot, shot Hugos in the chat? Clear mistake. And you saw the delay after the gentleman. He tried to see if he can catch that jump. That up air could have definitely led into something really beautiful. Good. Just exhibiting patience right here, none. 
Probably just trying to bait out Hugs' dash attack. But Hugs looks like he's going reverting back to the four tilts. Oh. This is so close right now. Oh, wow. 2 0 lead for none. 2 0. 2 0. It's actually happening. Man, is, is Hugs going to be able to, to bring this back? We'll I hope so. I hope we get a uh, game five. At least a game four situation. I feel like he I feel like he's conditioning hugs now, man. It's crazy. Man, Nun is just such a smart player. And you you usually don't see that when, when a player is so fast and so smart, that's why he's such a threat. Such a threat. I know there was a common misconception in the past where if a player is like really fast and technical that they don't think that they're just autopilot, but this is not the case with yeah. Nun. He actually knows what he's doing. There's the drift again, catching Hugs off guard, potentially waiting for a, an on-platform recovery. There it is, Hugs manages to get the forward smash, but let's see. Ooh. Oh man, it's looking like Nun was using the Ganon set to download Hugs, and now against the Captain Falcon, he's not uh, he's just not being able to defend himself. Yeah, or maybe, you know, like, it, I just feel like at this juncture, Hugs is still in that anti Ganon mode. Or maybe, you know, just tossing all those characters in there is just definitely throwing them off. Is this the age of the dual mains? Oh, it definitely is. If you look at the likes of players like Armada, Mango, PPMD, and so on. I was asking Hugo last night about uh, his second potential secondaries, and he's telling me um, the only secondary I have is. Uh, very bad chic. Yeah. But I uh, I think if he practices it, he might be able to like bring it out up to speed with his other characters. Oh yeah, indeed. I mean, you look at Plup, right? Plup made his chic into something really beautiful to watch. Yeah. And such a hard opponent. In just a year or something like that. All right. Oh, look. Hugs look like he's trying to get himself back on the scoreboard. It's too early to say, though. Oh. Yes. Oh, Very, no. oh no, you don't want to see that. Are we going to see a homie stock from Hugs though? Of course not. <laughs> of course not. <laughs> He's like, wait a second, I have the lead. I'm Hugs okay. with the bomb tech. Oh, the grab. That SD might just be what Hugs oh. need to do. Definitely looks like it. Okay, managing to finally get this dash attack. It looks oh. like he overshot it pretty well. Got the four tilts just to knock him on away, and he has game three. Here we go. On Very to game good. four, ladies and gentlemen. On to game four. Let the shows go on. Uh-oh. Nun said. Back to Ganon. He's like, all right, well, you had enough of Captain Falcon. Let's see if you can handle this again. <laughs> He tried to go really deep for that grab. And again, you know, Nun already took a set with Ganondorf. Might be able to do it again. I think it, uh, it's mostly the counter pick because uh, Yoshi says by far his Ganon's best stage. So he would much rather do Ganon than Falcon on the stage, specifically. True. Really good observation. So now when it comes to facing off against Ganondorf in the air, I notice Hugs, you know, he really likes sometimes going for the fairs. Oh, Ooh. the Shy guy's messing him up. Yeah, they, they actually made it really easy for Hugs to react to the Shy guys. Uh-oh. It looks like Hugs forgot about that wall, uh, that wall tech back here. Oh, that is so risky with those edge guards. Is he going to lose a stock to that? So close. You know, Nun is just so good at keeping you in check with his jabs. Sometimes players here, uh, you know, liken it to a shine the way he uses his jabs with Captain Falcon. And oh my god! Going so deep for that! Damn, Nun is fearless. Did you see the angle that that screw attack sets him so. That's such a weird angle. Hugs willing to take that trade. That was probably the same angle that gimped him in that other game in Final Destination, remember? Yeah. Truth, truth. 
look at him moving like Captain Falcon, but with Ganondorf. Hugs uh, wants to get that down smash, but he's trying to stay at a range where he doesn't potentially take a fair to the face. Oh. See, that's the risk in trying to go for those fairs, man, because if none catches Hugs jumping too soon while he's grounded, Hugs could take a couple up airs. Uh-oh. I'm guessing that was probably a fair by none. Regardless, right now, he does have the control. It's looking good. Giving Hugs a taste of his own medicine with those four oh. tilts. Wow. Man, wow. that reverse grab is just crazy. That was a super brave dash attack, but it at least allowed him to get out of the corner. Man, none doesn't stop attacking at any second. Definitely doesn't. Where's the roll? He's not going to roll. He's going to just stay there and wait until he finally has an opportunity to play. Oh, nice grab. Very good mash. Oh, I feel like, okay, I thought none was going to go for a dare there, but dare does have lag. Wizard foot. What is he going to do here? Okay. Oh. No jump. He had no jump. He thought he did. is just trying to keep up with this guy. None! That was crazy, getting out of the screw attack like that. Hugs has no jump again. Okay. Opportunity. Oh, the reversal. Oh, is this gonna turn into an edge guard? Maybe, it looked like it. And again, none showing hugs that he can't just stay on the platforms like that. He will grab him. <gasps> Woo! Those, those empty jumps from none are too good. Just so many good mix-ups that he's nice. kind of playing with the character. Nice Trying missile from Hux. Yeah. Tying up the game. But Hux is not out of the woods yet. He still has a deficit. Oh my Ooh. gosh! It's not over yet. Very nice combo. A decent 53, but he loses the charge shot. Damn. Let's see what he does here. Hugs. On notice. Every percentage counts. Crowd cheering for one more stock. One more stock for uh -oh. none. Oh, but man, I want to see a game five. I don't think we'll, we might see one. It's We'll see, though. I know Hugo can do it. Oh, being in the air like that. Okay, there's an opportunity. He gets the tech chase on that platform. Is he going to try to go for those neutral airs again? <gasps> All right. What? Missiles. Now. Hugs just trying to see if he can close out the edge guard. Yes. Trying to rack up as much damage Even as possible. Game. He doesn't get the fully charged charge shot. None waiting. So fortunate right there for Hugs. Oh. Oh, oh my god. You don't want to see that ever. Well, congratulations, your champion for Super Smash Brothers Melee here at Smash Factor 5 in Puebla, Mexico, is none representing even matchup gaming. Huge shout outs to uh, Toronto Joe. Yes, Toronto Joe. Um, big friend of Smash Factor. Oh, absolutely. EMG and Smash Factor, big friends. And a big shout out to Salil, who you know is an amazing technical director that works for the even matchup gaming team. Uh,